First of all, as usual, we're going to start from the bottom. So we're going to make the legs. And to do so, we are going to need four small balls of brown and four pale yellow fondant. Stick them together and roll them. Bend it to create the foot and then draw the spaces between the fingers. Gently insert a cocktail stick so they can stay still on the cake. And do the same three more times. To make the body we are going to need some brown and some dark blue fondant. We need to stick them together and to put them on top of the legs. For the collar I've pressed a black ball of fondant and made a hole in the center with a ball tool and stick it on the body. Then I'm going to make a very thin shape and put it at the front of Chase's body. To make the patch, as it is very small, I do it by hand. And the same thing I do with the star again because I don't have a cutter and it is very small. So it's not easy to do it. Very carefully I made it with a craft knife. I do the same thing with the side badge because it's very small. So first of all I place a novel of a black fondant, cut it the sides and then I apply some yellow fondant and try to match the badge as much as possible. To make the neck I'm using some brown fondant, it just place it in the middle of the collar. Instead to make the head I'm using some brown fondant, it's a novel and to get all the measurement you can check in my blog. To make the mouth I'm using the same fondant color of the feet. And what I do is that with the um, pinky, I roll just the side of it so that I get a bigger mouth in the middle. Then I draw the mouth and place two ovals where the eyes are going to be. With the ball tool I'm making the holes where the eyes are going to be and then apply some white fondant and press it, trying to give it the same shape as the eyes. Then for the irises I'm going to add some brown fondant and then for the pupils some black and just a hint of white fondant for the lights that Chase got in the eyes. For the nose I'm placing a triangle of a black fondant and then I'm added some more yellow pale fondant in the neck. For the eyebrows I'm just placing two small strips of black fondant To make the heart, instead I'm using some 
dark blue and with my fingers I press and turn it around until I get that heart shape and I make a hole in the middle of the heart so that, that I can put the head in it again using some dark blue I'm uh, shaping the front of the heart and place it on top of the eyebrows to make the ears I'm using some brown fondant and what I do first I make an oval and then I try to make pointy to one side and the same thing I do with some pink fondant it's kind of peachy fondant really and I place it on top of it and press a little bit once done I can put it onto the head I'm adding a strip of uh, yellow fondant onto the hat and uh, remove any excess fondant to make the backpack I'm using some uh, very dark uh, blue and I'm making a rectangle from it and on the sides of the backpack I'm adding some small pieces of blue fondant with some more brown fondant I'm adding the tail finally I paint the freckles on, on Chase's mouth with some brown marker and then with some silver dust and some alcohol I paint the badges I hope you liked this video, if so don't forget to thumbs up and to leave a comment, I really would like to know what you think about it. Instead, if you are new to the channel, subscribe so you won't miss any new video tutorial. On my channel you will find video tutorials of the most beautiful cartoons about Valentine's Day and much much more.